I'm Joe. I'm a, a serial entrepreneur, so I, I've built and sold a number of different companies, and that's kind of led me deep into the tech world. So I'm doing a lot of things like just assembling companies as fast as I can. The startup world is very much an environment where um, speed is everything, so you need to be, you know, pressing. You kind of need to be grinding and pushing that forward. A lot of Sabbath is like, it's almost like preparing for war to go back into this place where I'm leading up, you know, Tons of people. It's, it's that refiner's fire that preps me for the week that way. Everything in my life tells me to go faster, work harder, increase your productivity. You know, how much did you get done in an hour? Okay, like, <laughs> how many more hours can you do? Those are the types of questions that I'm re regularly faced with, of like, oh, these are the, these are the ways to improve um, and increase the richness of my, you know, experience and, um, you know, do the human condition well. And yeah, I think Sabbath just proved that wrong in my heart. Um, I mean, it's stopping and slowing down, so it's very much like, a big piece is in the morning recognizing, whoa, this was the pace that I've been moving at this week. I'm going so fast, I need to slow down. And sometimes you don't even get eyes to see how fast you're moving until you're removed from the situation and, and you're ready to like kind of chronologically declare freedom over your life. I'm like, okay, this is an architecture in time where I'm stepping into the temple with the Lord. Um, and it's not about productivity. It's not about walking away with anything. It's just about being blown by the wind. And I think that's so opposite because you know, the world's like, okay, plan, what's your plan? You know, how are you in control? You know, those, these types of questions that I feel like Sabbath, um, it, I mean, it subverts and, and, and breaks down. It's almost, it kind of does it from the inside out though.